This week's top InfoSec stories include Apple Tech's bomb bug, Zyklon malware on the rise, Intel patch slowdown, and Facebook stealing apps found on Google Play. This is Hacker Weekly for Friday, January 19th, 2018, and I'm your host, Marley Oxenholm. Many iPhone users have now been affected by the Apple text bomb bug. For those who haven't heard of it, the flaw was discovered by software developer Abraham Masri, who then posted about it on Twitter, saying, do not use it for bad stuff. The bug is essentially a message containing a specific website link that causes the system to crash once it's been clicked on. However, security professionals say that it's relatively harmless and is used mostly for pranking contacts. The issue can be fixed by deleting the thread that the link was sent in, resetting iPhone factory settings, or blocking the domain of the site hosting it. In other news, it seems that hackers recently exploited Microsoft Office vulnerabilities in order to distribute Zyklon malware. This was discovered by cybersecurity researchers at FireEye, and Zyklon has been observed in the wild since around 2016. The malware is a publicly available, full-featured backdoor capable of keylogging, password harvesting, downloading and executing additional plugins, DDoS attacks, and self-updating and self-removal. Zyklon is primarily delivered through spam emails with an attached zip file containing a malicious document. FireEye advises to ensure that all of your software is fully updated. And the new Intel security patches have caused a significant number of reboots and slowdowns. In an update on its website, Intel said the reboot problem has been identified in its Ivy Bridge, Sandy Bridge, and Skylake processors. After running several tests, the company also saw a reduction in performance ranging from 2% to 25%. In the latest update regarding the issue, Intel said it was able to reproduce the problem and was making progress towards identifying the root cause. And lastly, it appears that Facebook password-stealing apps were discovered on the Google Play Store. Security firms Trend Micro and Avast have found a new piece of malware known as Ghost Team in at least 56 applications on Google Play that it's designed to steal Facebook login credentials and display constant pop-up advertisements to users. The malicious apps are commonly disguised as utilities such as flashlight, QR scanner, compass, and more. Fortunately, all of the apps have been removed by Google from the Play Store after they were reported to the company. However, users who have already installed one of these apps on their devices should make sure that they have Google Play Protect enabled. Well, that's all the time I have for you guys today. But before I go, I'd like to give a special shout out to at Insomniac on Twitter for posting a picture of his new Hacker Arsenal swag. Thanks for the support. And if you want to be featured in an upcoming episode of Hacker Weekly, snap a picture of your new gear, post it on social media, and tag us using hashtag HackerArsenal so we can find you. This episode was brought to you by Pentester Academy, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Join over 10,000 professionals from 90 countries to learn security online. Also brought to you by Hacker Arsenal, artillery for cyber warriors. Visit us on HackerArsenal.com to check out our latest attack defense gadgets. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.